It was the most watched news show on Crackle, and now In the Vault is getting ready to premiere season two. We're joined by actress and star of In the Vault, Audrey Whitby. It's great to have you. Hi, thank you for having me. I'm just so excited to talk to you guys. Goodness gracious, the number one watched news show on Crackle. First, how does it feel to know that you starred in such a popular hit? Well, I think we're at like three million something views. And I mean, really what I'm excited about is for everybody to see um, the hard work that the entire cast and crew put into the show. We really had, even though uh, <laughs> there might be some murder involved, I don't know how murder is fun, but we had a lot of fun. So <laughs> well, the, the, the mystery surrounding it certainly is quite intriguing. So what is In the Vault about? Well, um, season two comes out August 18th. So for everybody um, to catch up on season one, they should know that uh, a college freshman happens to tragically be murdered uh, a month into the school year. And the whole show kind of surrounds the surviving dorm mates. And, uh, you know, each week one is a protagonist and then like a suspect the next and everybody has their own secrets and motives. And so um, the show really starts a dialogue of, you know, who done it. So it it's, it's, it's almost like Clue only set on a college campus. Exactly, it was Mr. White with the rope. No, yeah. You're right, exactly, exactly. So, so starring in this kind of a show, is this a departure from other roles that you've played? Oh, definitely, this was like, a major left turn for me. I'm from the sitcom world. I was on Thunderman's. I was Cherry for um, so many years, and I loved that. So this was a challenge in its own way. But you know, Jane is also kind of insecure and starting her um, you know college career. So I was able to use that. Yes, yes, exactly. So so tell us a little bit more about Jane. So how does she fit in within the entire series within the story? Well, you know, Jane is just sweet and sheltered. She wouldn't hurt a fly, right? Uh, Who knows? For, for, I mean, by looks, absolutely. But something <laughs> tells me that she has a dark, deep secret. <laughs> yes, exactly. Um, I think I'm episode two because what's so fun is each episode surrounds one character where you really get to do a deep dive into them. and. There's arguments for every character. It's like each one has a really good motive. So that's what's so fun about the show is kind of, you know, gathering around and everybody having their own opinion. Sure. Um, I didn't even really know who it was going to be until I read the script until the last episode. So it's... Uh. I, Very I've, I, I've got it on my list. I can't wait to see this. Now I have to draw attention to those roller skates that are in the background there. Uh, what's the story behind those? Well, um, I'm a former Derby girl, Malibu's Barbie. <laughs> Malibu's Barbie. Yeah, once uh, I was aged out of the junior league, I was like, oh no, I can't. I how can't. did you? How does one get into roller derby? I must ask. I was at some really cool vintage shop and the owner just happened to like have skates around and I was intrigued and I asked her and then before I knew it, I was in the rink um, with my mouth guard and my elbow pad. <laughs> So, just like that. Really, just like that. It just rolled right into your heart. Well, <laughs> it's probably best for your career that you left roller derby because you don't want to mess with this too much. Exactly. Bruises don't read well on camera, it turns out. No. So. <laughs> but Malibu's Barbie is a fantastic name, so kudos to you on that one. Uh, what is next for you? So now season two is getting ready to launch on August 18. What is next for you, Audrey? Yes, I'm so excited for everybody to, like I said, binge season one and catch up. So that way they're all ready for season two, August 18th. Um, the season two trailer just dropped on Downright Creepy. Uh, and it's just, I love seeing the trailer. It brings back all the memories. And until then, yeah, I've got a couple things in the works that hopefully will come out within the next year. Um, and yeah, just August 18th, okay. season two, I'm excited. Fantastic, we'll make sure to follow you on your social media handles to see exactly what is coming up for you. But again, congratulations. It sounds like a really interesting, spooky kind of a storyline. Uh, definitely, I think you're gonna have the attention of a lot of our audience to see this as well. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. In the Vault, coming up August 18th. We're back after this.